they trail as we start quarter number four. Welcome back to another Madden 17 Let's Play video. Today in this video, I will be continuing on my franchise and just watch two videos ago. On yeah. first down, he'll drop to the throw. If you don't want to go back, field, it is it's that I relocated the Miami Dolphins to Utah. If you want to hear the reasons and stuff, well, it would be a lot easier to just go watch that so you can see the whole game. My last video, no, two videos ago, and then the video before this. try again with the arm here on second down. Toward the right sideline, but it's incomplete. So incomplete on second down. Now they'll look to convert here on third. Kansas City coach. Now a shotgun snap as they'll look to throw. And he'll just toss it away. So he throws it away and that brings up fourth down. Whether they deserve credit or not, the defense is going to take credit for that incompletion because it always feels good when you slow down an offense. We're going to go left and go left, right? I don't know. Something trying to score here. Oh my god. Oh my god. Catch it, catch it. No. And problem spreading to the punt team now. This one goes all the way into the end zone on the fly, so that'll come back to the 20. Now this offensive unit ready to see what they can do here. And last time the formula was pretty simple. One play drive, long pass. So maybe they just want to do that again, right? And that's exactly how you want to draw things up. Whether it's on your grease board, right, in your playbook, one play drives exactly what you want on offense. But they have to be careful of is not having a letdown. It yeah. was real easy last time. They can't expect that going forward. And we'll see if it's that easy here. Hey, and now hey, they're in the hurry up. Hey, and they'll go with a ground attack here. He'll get about three as he's taken down at the 23. A sea of Chiefs jerseys in there that time to make the stop. So third and seven and an extra defensive back on the field here. Definitely want to good coverage here. Throwing on third down, Tannehill escaping the pressure right. Ooh, gotcha. Got it. Bullet throw, but incomplete. What? What? And we'll see about that one. We will see about that one. Watch. Catches it. Look. Caught one. Oh, never mind. Dang it. Fake it Here's Drew Butler now in Drums punt formation, but as we've seen, that's no guarantee he'll punt the football. And look at this, another fake. Got it. Throwing right, and that's complete. And the fake will work. He's going to have a it first down. Work. It it's always a big works. play that time on the fake punt. Oh, and they're able to pick win, up the conversion here on fourth down. Oh, so the offense has it first and ten. Okay, that was a fake punt, and it was successful throwing the football. I know you threw the football in your past off of a fake. Yeah, but unsuccessful back in my high school days. Old Tim Jones dropped it, hit him right in the numbers. But I'll tell you what, these guys, they love this opportunity, don't they? A chance to get involved. They certainly do, and many of them were quarterbacks or big-time players when they were in high school and college. So to get back doing what they did before, always fun. Offense looking to avoid a third and long. It's second and ten. No, 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 no. No, no, no. And they'll go ground game here with a tailback. And down to the 36-yard line here. Second down, a little more productive than first. Seven yards on the gain. And it gets them to third and three now. And in this situation with the lead fourth quarter, they're liking keeping the ball on the ground, I'm sure. That's just smart football, but you know the defense has to know it as well. They've got to stop them here. So now we're going to see that loading the box in a big way. Six, seven, eight, nine, whatever it's going to take, puts a little bit more pressure on your big offensive line. They'll run the option left. And he'll be brought down, losing yardage back at the 40. He loses four, and it brings up fourth. And on this play, the read for the quarterback was the defensive end, and he was totally focused on the quarterback. He should have given it off inside to the running back. Instead, he kept it. And they won't try and pooch it. It's a fake. And he's going to let it go deep. What? And this is incomplete. A huge gamble, and it does not pay off. Well, not only did they try to fake it, they put the ball in the arm of their punter, and it didn't work out. Not the quarterback. No. 
the, the punter. Oh, yeah. Yeah, and, Risky. And, and it's so funny because when it works, genius. genius. When it doesn't that work, work, not, not so, so smart. Not so In this case, not so genius, but I do admire that he went for it. Looking left side, he's got it complete. It'll go as a gain of 10 there, and that'll be good for a KC first down. A good start there on first down. They've got to have this drive. No doubt about it. Down a couple of scores. They have to find a way to put it in the end zone. Chunk plays, explosive plays. That will be the key to this drive. You don't catch. You don't catch the ball. You don't catch. You don't catch. Second down following the incompletion. You don't catch. Don't catch the ball. You don't catch. From the midfield strike, they'll look to throw. And he comes back with one complete. A nice pick up there, 10 yards, and it'll move the sticks. And a nice pitch and catch to pick up the reception against man coverage. Both of them read how much yardage they needed, figured what they had to do, and were able to beat the man coverage for the completion. Now back to throw. Quick hitter here, it's complete. Time for a break. We're back to finish this one off after this. So the Chiefs in possession of the ball as we welcome you back. They've got a first and 10 as they search for a late score. Now on first down, he'll drop to throw it. Throwing left side here, and it's complete. And down inside the 15, shy of the 10. 17 yards on the pickup there, and the drive will continue. And now it looks like they're going to be in the hurry up. They'll look to throw here on first down. He's going to flip one out here to his running back. And certainly some style points there on the spin. Not a whole lot thereafter, but still a pretty good game. <laughs> They'll stick with the passing game as he looks to throw. That's caught at the one. And he'll be brought down right on the edge of the goal line at about the one-yard line. Looking to speed things up here, going with some tempo. They'll look to throw again. Feeling the pressure here and taken down. A sack back at the center. And a sack leads to roughly a loss of six, and it brings up second and goal. Out of the gun, they'll look to throw. Throwing for his running back, and he's got him complete. Keep him out it's a gain of zone. six on the play, and that's going to bring up an interesting third and goal. And they're going to hurry back to the line now. They'll look to throw for it on third and one. And he dropped it. Now it was tipped, altered the ball a little bit, but he dropped it, and now fourth down. When we're not playing three yards in a cloud of dust football anymore. I kind of get why those old school coaches sometimes didn't want to throw the football. Because if it's popped up in the air, it almost turns into slow motion. And both sides trying to get to the football, and you're holding your breath wondering whether it's going to go good or bad for your team. And this is caught in no. a touchdown. So hold everything here. This one's not over yet. And there's the touchdown yeah. that they needed, so they'll celebrate, but the guys on the sidelines, they they've got to stay focused. The oh, onside kick team, kick they out. need them to get the ball back. Yeah, part one of the equation done. Now they need to convert and get that onside kick. So that one along 11 play drive. And it winds up with the Chiefs hitting Pater. And this is going to be recovered by the hand team. And that should just about put a capper on this one. Uh, fourth quarter, they felt like they needed the football back. Unfortunately, they couldn't get it. And I know we brought analytics into the game, and someone has said here that the data says that when a team's expecting an onside kick, 80% of the time, the team expecting it, they do actually recover the ball, which is what we saw here. I just wonder if that number is much more of a anecdotal type of a number. Kind of like when the coaches tell us, well, when you score on special teams, 93% of the time you win the game. I'm still waiting to see that number is empirical. Looking to jam the receivers at the line here. Press coverage, look defensively. Here's the option going right. Dang it. 
And the Chiefs are going to signal for and be granted another timeout. That'll be their second, so one more chance to stop the clock here. And we'll be back. the option going right and he'll lose yardage on the play back at the 37 yard line it's a loss of two now third down Tannehill to a knee, and that ought to be the final act of this ball game. Yes. And how about this? Fourth and long, and they're going to go for it. Yep, there's the game. And Charles, I think when the schedule yes. comes out, all teams, no matter where they're predicted to finish, talk about protecting your home turf. They were able to do that here in this one. Similar to a tennis match, right? Not letting them break your serve. That way you hold on to it. They got it done, and they feel very good about that victory. I like my quarterback right now. My starter. He's good. Thank you all for watching this video, and I hope you enjoyed it. And see y'all next time. Bye 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 bye.